of the love of God and you can't believe he'll do that for you. Anybody out there in YouTube, don't you dare give up. God's not willing to give up on you. Don't you quit. Don't you give up the ghost on your faith. Don't you throw in the towel on your hopes in God. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. I was with my husband till he drew his last breath. He was right here in his house with his wife. God is with you through your last breath. He's with you throughout eternity. If you make your bed in hell, God is there. You won't like it because you're in hell. But you'll always be aware of God. You have to know that God, he sticks closer than a brother. I don't know how else to paint the picture of how much God loves you. I don't know how else to to illustrate that, that whole concept that may be foreign to you because you may not have been raised by parents who loved you. You may not have had faithful family members that really had your best interests at heart. You may have been hurt on the left hand, hurt on the right hand, stabbed in the back and jabbed in the front and knocked down and, and counted out for dead. You may have been given up on. You may have spent half your life in prison, jail, whatever. You may have been on the streets selling your behind or pimping other women to sell their behinds. Who knows what you've been doing with your life? But once you walk with God, there's a song my friend in high school used to sing. I walk with God. He walks with me. It ain't a one-way relationship now. No. God doesn't leave you dangling out there by yourself. Just because you can't see him. Just because you can't see the roots of your growth and development. Just because you can't see the power that works within. Just like you can't see the air you breathe. Does not mean it's time to give up. No, you got to hold on because God's fullness of time is going to prove and demonstrate to you his salvation, his power, his abilities in your life. And you will marvel one day. And you'll say, if it hadn't been for the Lord who was on my side, Bless the Lord, O oh my soul, and all that is within me, bless his holy name. Bless the Lord, O oh my soul, and forget not all his benefits, who healeth all thy diseases. Mm -hmm. I don't want to misquote, so I'm going to stop there. I think I already skipped the line. But bless the Lord, O oh my soul. God bless you. God will keep you. Mm. He will keep you in perfect peace if you keep your mind stayed on him. Get your mind off of you. Peter sunk because he got his mind stayed on those waves instead of on Jesus. Keep your mind stayed on him. He'll never let you fall. He'll never let you fall. He is never weary, and he will not let you fall. God bless you. I can go on and on, but for the sake of time, I hope you've heard enough to encourage you. Be encouraged. 
As God was with Moses, so will he be with thee. Amen.